Hello everybody, my name is Walter and welcome back to Rick and Marty Season 3 Episode 9. This is the ABCs of Beth. Uh, now, since I cannot find a uh, compromising ground between copyright claims because Turner EMA and Turner Entertainment is a bitch and uh, Adult Swim doesn't understand the meaning of fair use and uh, you guys don't seem to understand what's uh, fair use because I know some of you have reported me. Um, and it all failed. <laughs> um, uh, so, and a lot of you guys complaining about either the audio going out, uh, even though I told you guys that the audio was going to go out, and or people um, uploading because I speed up the audio. Although I already told you I'm gonna speed up the audio because copyright. Um, so what I'm gonna do is this time I'm gonna cut the scenes. So if you see any scenes cut out for any reason, you know why. Uh, so yeah, let's jump right into this one because I know a lot of you guys just want to see the re uh, reaction and don't care what I'm talking about right now. So let's get into this one. Let's go. In local news, child murderer Joseph Eli Lipton is scheduled to die tomorrow by lethal injection. His execution already drawing dozens more spectators than the death of TV News. Carla? The man that once ate his own son. Wow, he's really getting executed after all this time. You know the son that he ate was- Your best friend Tommy, we know. Stop true crime bragging. I was traumatized, Summer. Okay, your generation wouldn't get that. Bitch, my generation gets traumatized for breakfast. It took years <laughs> of therapy true. to even process the reality. I mean, when I was a kid, I just told myself that Tommy had gotten lost in the magical realm of Fruity Land. Fruity Land? My make-believe world. I know the name's stupid, but it was so real to me. Aren't you guys supposed to be at your father's for custody weekend? We're not in a hurry. Dad sleeps until sundown. Can we talk a little bit more about this Fruity? <laughs> not the bubble gun there's no air i gotta say i am warming up to the bubble gun you know if you're so great at naming things why don't you do it from now on what fruity land was it my best work i don't know does it deserve to be shit on creatively yeah that's right i agree with your look of horrified realization you can be very inconsiderate sometimes all right, all right, here it is. You know, it collapsed a quantum tesseract. Dad, yeah, I don't care how you made it. I want to know if Tommy's still in there. Relax, Beth. If he is, we'll find him. He'll be the only sun bleached skeleton with non imaginary DNA. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, that was awkward. <laughs> uh, and it seems that uh, they decided to copyright the uh, after credit sequence as well. Hey, all power to them. If they need the money, I'm complaining. So, there you go. <laughs> that still gets me. Okay, I don't care how many times I see it. I always laugh at that joke. Tommy! Tommy! This is a nightmare. I can't believe it used to lock me up in this glorified chicken coop. Chicken coop? Those are procedurally generated clouds, Beth. That river is a rainbow, literally. Come on, I, I, I put real elbow grease into this place. Well, you're supposed to put elbow grease into your daughter. Gross. Do you think something ate him? Nope. Fruity land creatures were designed to be harmless. He Sorry definitely just starved to death. I could have been the one videos. who starved to death. Yeah. What if I got hurt? Dad, you're right. I'm a terrible dad. Well, nothing to live for. Goodbye, cruel world. Dad! Oh, how do you like that? What kind of merciless creator makes the ground bouncy? I'm gonna have to drown myself. <laughs> Oh no, oh, the water's breathable? Who went and did that? Oh, whatever. Yeah, whatever. A dad makes yeah, a toilet whatever. look like R2-D2 and it breaks the front page of Reddit. But I'm Charles Manson because I gave you your own world instead of an iPad. I think the words you're looking for are... Ah, holy oh. fuck, this thing has claws! Yeah, I get it, it's a childproof world. No, no, seriously, this hurts really bad! This thing is sinking razor-sharp claws in... Ah, You've made your point, Dad! Dad? Yeah, he's not kidding. <sighs> Whose idea was this stupid custody weekend thing? I, I think it's supposed to help prevent abandonment issues. I want to be abandoned. Yeah, I'm talking about Dad. Bienvenue à la chaise de voice, Dad. Wow, Dad. Your place looks way less like a crack house. It's actually clean, like a cocaine house. <laughs> Dad, what's going like on? A cocaine I'm house. simply centered, activated, and telekinetic. Pretty cool, huh? Check it out. Who wants a smoothie? Oh, oh no. Uh, oh god. Summer, yeah. Summer, can you grab? Sorry. You have much to learn, my Ulu. Morty, Summer, this is Kiara. 
She's a Crew Tabulon warrior priestess from Crew Tabulon. Uh, I know where Crew okay. Tabulons are from, Dad. A uh, Chimen Tolo. Chimen Tolo, younglings. Chimen Cholo. Your father's no. mind holds love for you. I am humbled to meet in physicality. Dad, are you in love with a badass, sexy alien lady? <laughs> I don't know, Summer. You tell me. I wasn't going to ask if you were in love since you barely know her. Summer. Kiara and I <laughs> met on that interstellar dating service Rick was always suggesting when your mom and I were together, and things just kind of clicked. We must move. Our reservation is at seven. I hate to see her leave, but I love to watch her face shift away. I'm sure Whoa. you noticed what she has three of, but guess what she has two of? Shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh! All right, knock it off. Listen, I've been giving you a pass because I'm charmed that life finds a way, but... Uh, all right, you know what? <laughs> oh! oh. Yeah, this place is the safest. Best dad ever. Can't you just say, I admit it, I screwed up? Uh, what would be the point of that? <laughs> you can't do it, can't you? You can't just f***ing apologize. Okay, okay, Beth, I'm sorry you think you deserve an apology. <laughs> hey, don't look at me. You let your kid roll around on the floor of a target, it's gonna get stepped on. <laughs> huh, well, here's the problem right here. We got a bunch of Fruity Land procedural carbons all gummed up and mixed in with real human DNA. Are you saying Tommy survived here by having sex with Fruity creatures, creating Fruity human hybrid offspring, and then consuming their protein, sustaining himself with an endless cycle of cannibalistic incest? It's just a working theory. Of course, if that's the case, I expect he'd be worshipped as a kind of god by a medieval-level society of his least delicious children. Halt! You are now prisoners of our exalted ruler, giver and taker of life, humper and consumer of mortality, dispenser Guys, of life. Guys, if I can interrupt, we're way ahead of the reveal here. Yeah, just take us to King Tommy. I thought warrior priestesses could only leave Crutabulon on a hunt. Thank you, sweetie. I hope it's not human season. I'm on Earth hunting the Varex. I would never hunt a human. Your father and I are soul bonded. Soul bonded? Okay. Um, does your planet have shorter days? Because you guys are moving kind of fast now. Oh. <laughs> Go get him, honey. She's always hunting. <laughs> She probably knew if Eric's worked here, and that's why she said the Yelp reviews didn't matter. Dad, do you understand how serious Crutabulon's soul bonding is? Uh, gee, Morty, I don't know. It's got such a casual name. If you want to lecture anyone about commitment, start with your mom. Oh, oh. my god. Dad, is that what this is about? Are you rushing into a new thing to get back at mom? Every weekend, you two have told me to move on. Move on, like, out of bed. Like, stop using paper towels for toilet paper. Not move on into a sloppy rebound. Dad, you need to slow down. Rethink this soul bond. Why don't you just say what you really mean. You think it's cool that having sex with her gives me telekinesis, and you recognize she's got a hot bod like Chitara in Thundercats, but you're grossed out by her avocado-shaped head and blue skin, and you think I want to put a bag and a wig on her head. After all the time and energy I spent teaching you two about race, you ended up racist. Oh. Soon your world will be rid of Varex. Tomorrow, we celebrate. We could take the kids to the water park. We celebrate with a hunt. Ooh. You kids want to hunt? Yes. yes. <laughs> I'll kneel for King Tommy! I'm not kneeling. Suck my d Well, hello, all. I am the king of Fruity Land, but I go by another name, too. We know. It's... Tommy. We know. We know. I have lived here it's since I was a Tommy. mere child. We know. Got it. I suppose you're wondering, how do I sustain myself? Oh, boy. No, we aren't. I always find the theater is the best way to clarify things. Seriously? Oh, oh my God. Players, go. I am little Tom. I am Tiny Beth. Oh, come on. Come with me to my magic world. Don't do it. This is my secret floopy land, where I have no rules. I am excited. I am jealous of Tommy's friends in this Nintendo, and his dad likes him. I take it Tommy wasn't class playwright? Do you want to see the honey swamp? Class yes. playwright. Let's do it. Well, I want to see you dead. Ow, help. I'm stuck. I'm covered in honey. Huh, well, that's interesting. Fake news. Many nights have passed, <laughs> trapped in this strange land. Nice. I'm hungry, and all I can do to pass the time is hump. I will hump this rock. I will hump this tree. 
I will hunt this beast of the land and put my seed in it. Certified Perhaps fish. a demonstration. Eating babies. Yep. Really Luckily, that's not our problem. Time to pull the babies. plug. Pull the plug. <laughs> You're a scary Well, did admit that so you were a bad part. father? Oh, dude, uh, that was a good no, bad father all the way. Fake police oh badge, God. location tracking stickers, <laughs> rainbow co Whatever you say, I love the magic talk, Steve though. Austin. Nice. I don't know why I just said that. No, tomorrow, good God. We hunt. Wow. Yeah, I'm gonna break up with it. <laughs> <clears throat> so, uh, yeah. you clearly just really like her for the breath, so right? What the oh my God, dad, dog! Obviously. Yeah, no kidding! Can you guys help me? What? How? Can I just tell her it's because of my kids? You know, like, you don't like the shape of her head or... That's you, dad! That's, That's you! you. <laughs> Clean up your own mess.
Born to stab. Yeah, he is not. Oh, so, it's nice to see two storylines running together. Hey. Yeah, he didn't want to come back, so, um... Yeah, hardly matters now, sweetie. Yeah, Let's hardly people get a chance now. to climb on top, take That's reality true. for a ride. What I wanna do. You can't oh. run forever. She's really pissed off. I know. It's kinda hot. Shut up! Shut up. Hunter Ooh, la, la. The children must
Machina. You're yeah. taking it. Varric's You're taking it. nest spread across 300 galaxies. And you just happened to pick this planet to hunt? That's Gorgon shit. Total Gorgon shit. <laughs> You're taking it. Next, Machina. Hey, guys. What's for dinner? How was Jerry's? The usual. Can we have pizza? Pizza sounds great. Hey, Rick, did you know my dad was dating an alien? No, gross. For the alien. Oh, crap. I think Arnaldo's is closed. Are you guys sure you want pizza? Arnaldo's isn't closed in the dimension where they didn't invent daylight savings. What would we do without you? I love you, Dad. Love you too, sweetie. By the way, that wasn't time travel. There were just a couple pizzas on the counter. I grabbed them. <laughs> By the way, that wasn't time travel. I just grab a couple pizzas off this counter. Nice. Nice. I, I would do that if I had a part of that, but I don't. <laughs> All right, this, this episode was a little better. Uh, I do, I do like the, um, do like the side story of the fruity land. That was really cool. That was really imaginative too, because. Uh, Breathable water. That was really good. That was a really good line. Uh, the adversary is like, nobody really keeps uh, answering machines around anymore because it's just for exposition on um, network television or television shows. Um, yeah, that was a really good episode. I did definitely think, uh, you know, uh, Beth chose to have a clone because that doesn't seem like uh, Beth, but um, we will never know. We will never know until they come out in the next episode and they're like, yep, you're right or I'm wrong. Who knows? Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just babbling right now. Uh, so, yeah, guys, again, uh, you will either be seeing me cutting out the audio or me cutting the scenes. Uh, either way. Uh, and I really enjoyed this episode as well just bring it back here for a little while uh, just because I really like the um, the bonding between uh, Beth and Rick and I think you know Rick realizes that he's a shit father and he's not gonna deny that and you know he's not looking to be good uh, or you know a good father in the eyes of anyone and I think that's such a bold choice even though it's not right it is still a bold choice and while it is somewhat psychological damaging to the child I definitely also think the child does did learn a lot of things because of you know his her father not being in her life a lot and I think you know, led her to understand more of Rick's side of the story, and also uh, we never know, we will never know about her fa uh, her mother actually, her father, her mother, uh, because you know so far there's no, not even like only this episode and a few other em episodes mentioned her mother, but uh, so far yeah we don't really know anything about the mother. We only know. Uh, a little bit because of the thing that happened but even for me I'm just like did that really happen or is it what Rick wanted the the um, bureau to see which is the first episode of this season uh, so yeah guys that was about it uh, again copyright I'm sorry about that but uh, that's life and uh, yeah I will see you at uh, uh, Channel Zero and Gotham and lots of things are coming back okay I think um, Riverdale is coming back this week no sorry in October uh, 11th October so I'll be there uh, with you guys watching with you guys 
Uh, I will also be covering um, The Flash, I think. I, I'm not really sure whether I want to stop it yet. Uh, if I meet an episode where I'm like, nope, not gonna do it anymore. I'm not gonna do it anymore. Because uh, I am pretty tired of that series. Uh, I think I, I quit Supergirl, but I'm not really sure whether I want to bring it back. I didn't even really complete the second season, to be honest with you guys. Uh, so yeah, I'll be covering a lot of things. And if you like this video, please leave a like. And if you'd like to see my other reactions with me going on um, throughout as well, please subscribe to me. And be notified about future videos by ringing the bell because YouTube has no other way to notify you guys uh, used to be through email but uh, nowadays YouTube are unsubscribing people just for fun I don't know why but that's life again <laughs> so yeah that's a lot that's about it guys uh, copyright is definitely going to be strong with this one so I'm gonna be editing my ass off of this one so see you guys in the next video see you then